Hi everyone, it's your boy Ricky here with Bromero Cards. I hope you're doing well today. I am so excited today because I have this big box here and I'm super excited to get this unboxed so that you guys can see what's inside of it. Now, I have a uh, glass mat that I got from uh, glassmatstudio.com. I purchased it probably five or six months ago. It's, uh, I believe it's 18 by 22, 18 inches by 22 inches. Love that glass board. It's amazing. It has some really cool features in it. And so I uh, reached out to glass boards and I said, you know, I really wanted this bigger one, but it was out, you know, the whole time that I was trying to get it. So I purchased the small one. Um, you know, I'm really interested in this bigger one. And they're like, you know what, let's let's send you the big one over. You can do a review. You can talk about it and show it off. So that's what I'm here to do today is to unbox this. I'm going to clean my glasses while I'm talking to you and show it off to you. So um, we're going to go ahead and get started here. This thing is big. It is really big. I can't wait. I'm surprised it's in one piece because apparently someone stepped on the box, but all right, so we'll go ahead and get this removed. I did open it just so that I can make this part easier. It's not as loud as for you guys. Um, I do have a self-healing mat um, on my desk. I usually just have that under my glass boards just to uh, have, like, stick control and all that stuff. So, all right. Woo! It's heavy, too. Wow. All right, here we go. Ugh. We're gonna try to speed this up in the video. Ugh. All right, here we go. Woo! You guys, that was a that was a journey. All right, so here we go. We have the glass mat. It comes really, really packed very well. We got a lot of styrofoam here. All right, and then this is the board. That's the back of it. All right, let's turn this bad boy around. It is heavy. Woo! There we go, you guys. Glassboard Studios. Woo! It is all white, which I love. Um, it is... 24 inches by 22 inches, amazing. Pretty much covers my whole desk here. My desk is a little dirty, I had to take everything off of it. But um, yeah, so this glass, it's scratch resistant. You can, you can get scratches on it, but you're not gonna take your X-Acto knife and be like <laughs> But you know, if you're like working on things like stencils and stuff, you can rub it and it's not gonna like, crack or cut into the glass. Um, one other thing that I love about this glass mat is they have these magnets that you can get on their website. <laughs> that are really strong. Um, and I just have them here on my little bar here for my um, camera that I have. But the glass mat is magnetic. So if you want to do stenciling, you can put your stencil right down on here, put the magnets on, and do stenciling right on the board. Pretty amazing. I love it. Um, again, I've used this to do ink blending on. I've done heat embossing. I've uh, gotten glue on it. It's pretty easy to uh, clean. Uh, when I do get glue on it and it kind of gets stuck on there, I just kind of take some alcohol, I rub it on there, and then it just comes off. Uh, you know, you can use like a credit card or something to scrape that off. It's pretty amazing. You do not want to submerge this in water, though. You just want to spray it with water and wipe it off. Um, I would say if you dip this in water, it's probably going to get underneath this and you don't want to mess. Um, so just... You know, be careful of that. It does come with little feet on the bottom, so it is raised off the desk, which is nice because you can move it and clean around and get the crumbs because we know as crafters, crumbs, paper, staples, embossing powder gets everywhere. You guys know I hate embossing powder. I hate the texture of it. Ugh, I do not enjoy it. 
Um, so I have had my smaller one and I would show it to you guys, but it's the camera is actually sitting on the glass mat. Um, but it's maybe about this size, you know, it's not, it's about a third, two thirds, maybe of the size of this. And I loved it. And I will always use it. It's just on my other desk that you guys can't see right now or my chest of drawers. Um, but yeah, I really think you guys would really enjoy this glass mat. Another good thing is I do filming on this and cause this is white. the cameras don't reflect too bad. Um, I did have a darker glass mat that was black or grayish and the lights would just shine right on it. And it was very apparent that you had lights above you. It kind of hurts your eyes when you're watching the video. So um, that greatly helps with this. They do have other colors. They have like a mint green. Um, I think there's like a blue, there's some floral prints that you can get. Um, really cool things. They also have other things like glass um, that you can hang on your wall and put pictures in and things like that. So make sure that you head over to glass, glassboardstudio.com and just check out all the products they have. The good thing about this is you guys, is they gave me a code that you guys can use to get 20% off your order. And that code is Bromero20. So if you decide to go there and purchase it, use that code that lets them know that I sent you there. It is an affiliate link, so I'll get a little bit of a moolah from it. And you'll get your glass mat at 20% off or any of the products that they have on their website. Um, as always, if you have any questions about the glass mat, please leave comments down below the video and I'll answer them to the best of my ability. But I can tell you right now, I love this glass mat, um, obviously, because I have two of them and I wanted the bigger one. I waited, waited, waited for this, you guys. I guess a lot of other people wanted this as well but I finally got it. It's going to be a permanent place on my desk and I hope that you guys will check it out and tell me what you think of your glass mat. So anyway, that's going to wrap this up. Make sure that you head over to their website, use Bromero 20 and I will talk with you guys later. Bye. Have a great day.